Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and I'm going to show you a quick way you could show a customer what your work's going to look like. And, and this is real simple, uh, but it's a curve, and you know, make sure they're happy with the amount of curve. I just did a little video on this on how to do this in the center of the page. And if I was going to send this to a customer, I would, you know, put in some a call out like this is the edge of the plaque, and you know, give them more information, and maybe even you know, uh, and this wouldn't be a bad thing to, uh, you know, go like this and give them the size. And um, make this a little bit bigger. And I'm using that to do that. I'm using the parallel dimension tool. And let's go to 100. So they could see it's 12 inches and you can move it up out of the way. And you could do another one is 12 by 8. But anyway, that's not the real reason for the video. Now, I have a program called Snagit that I love. It's actually the program right now that's recording this video. But you can go to Snagit, and I can't do it while this program is running, but you could capture a JPEG, and you could actually, you know, zoom in and then capture all this, and it's going to be a, a large file for them to be able to see what it looks like. Now, that's one, and I also did some... You know, so this way you can give the customer some different text. And, you know, you can list a bunch that you know that work or you think that are going to work in a gravy. Now, these aren't exactly to my curve because anytime you make a duplicate of a, a text that's been put to path and then broken up, and if you put something else, it's not the same curve. So you basically have to redo them every time. Anyway, but that's not the reason for the video. So I use Snagit and create a JPEG. But if you don't have Snagit, the best way I've found to send it to them would be to go to go to File, Save As, and we're going to call this Seat, and I've already got one, so I'm not, I'm not going to hit it. But then, well, we'll just say it. Well, it saved it again, but I, so Save As, let's go Seat 2, and then where this says Corral, Corral Draw, we don't want to save it as that. You want to go right here and you want to go, I'm going to save it as a PDF file. Press save. It's going to ask you some questions. Current document, yes, page one. Then you go to your email and you email it to somebody. And then this is what it looks like when they get the email. I sent it to myself, but this is a picture and they can actually enlarge it and look at it and make sure they're happy and, and you know, move it around, take this away, and, well, that didn't work. But anyway, they open up the email, they get a PDF. They tap on the PDF and they get a picture of it. So that's the best way I've found. Most people, most emails will open PDFs, I would think. And when you use Snagit, it's, you can actually get a better picture because you could actually download it. You could download this. I'm not going to take the time to do it on the computer for the video. Anyway, I hope that helped a little bit and thank you for watching.